What's up, guys? Uh, I did not get a chance to work on the S14 yesterday. I got uh, wrapped up in a customer car, but I did get a chance to measure a little bit just to see what the difference was in strut tower height, and it's actually pretty funny, so check that out. The passenger side here from the frame rail to that seam line is, you know, around 13 and 3 quarter, 13 and a half inches. I don't know if you guys can see that too well. Almost 14, 13 and 3 quarter. And then you come to this side, the, the destroyed side, and you do that same, or should I say a similar test, um, and we are closer to 16 on this side. So what that means is there's about a two inch difference in the height of the strut towers right now, which is like ridiculous. Could you imagine having a two inch different ride height from one side to the other, it would feel horrible. And this is with the motor removed, so there's no weight in front. So it would only get worse from there. It might be, instead of a two inch difference, it might be a three inch or a four inch difference. It would be crazy. Um, not to mention, I, I can't even imagine dumping a motor in here. This chassis would crumble under the weight of anything heavier than the KA, I'll tell you that. Yeah, so I didn't really get to work on it yesterday because uh, of customer cars and stuff. But uh, I will hopefully work on it later tonight. I don't know. Soon enough, I'll get to working on it and I'll give you some updates.